Madhya Pradesh has not had a non-BJP government since 2003, but the Congress has certainly upped its game this election season with old guard Kamal Nath and young Turk Jyotiraditya Sindhya at its helm in the state. So what are the reasons that Congress has seemingly performed well in this election? To speak of the factors that might have benefited the Congress, the first would be anti-incumbency. Though Shivrat Singh Chauhan, who is popularly known as Mamaji, maintained his pro-development image, fatigue against the government had crept in. And after a decade and a half of power, the people of state showed they wanted a change for which they pinned their hopes on the Congress party. Congress used this anti-incumbency sentiment to its advantage, promising benefits to farmers and opportunities of employment to the youth. Which brings me to the second point, which is unemployment. The issue of unemployment had marred Shivrat Singh Chauhan's government, lack of job creation and increasing number of unemployed youth in the state led to dissatisfaction amongst the youth. With unrest among the young voters, a change was what the state was perhaps looking at. The third factor would be the agrarian crisis in the state. The anger and high level of dissatisfaction among the farmers in the state played a big role. The farmers demanding better prices for their produce and their demand for a change in the establishment echoed during the state election. Images of dead farmers from Mansoor, where six protesting farmers were killed, have haunted the state government and costed a huge support base. The Congress somewhere used this anger to its advantage, with the party promising to write off farm loans and providing a minimum support price to farmers for their produce if voted to power. And finally, with Kamal Nath and Jyotiraditya Sindhya taking centre stage, the Congress party presented a united face and galvanised the votes of different sections of the society. The Congress also focused on a well-planned social media strategy along with the senior leaders hitting the campaign trail very early.